everyone, Jong here, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're checking out this classic pedal. This is the Boss DS1W, which means it's a Wasacraft pedal. I can still remember the, the first time I used this in my early days of playing guitar. So this has lots of good tone to it. Aside from that one, since that it's a Wasacraft, it has some special functions that I'm gonna show you later. And aside from that, I'm using this Jazz Master right here. It's a Fender Signature Series by Jim Root of Slipknot, and I'm gonna be using this white one and the black one later on over the Boss DS1W. And I'm also using a Fender Deluxe Verb. So let's check it out. This segment is presented to you by When I started guitar playing, I was really into Joe Satriani. Love his playing, love his articulation, especially I love his tone. Then I found out that his main pedal was the Boss DS1. So I got one myself. Joe Satriani really had this one particular DS1 that according to him, sounded different from the other DS1 in the market. And he even modeled the tone from this pedal in this IK Multimedia Amplitude JS. This pedal is no longer on my current pedal board, but it sure packs those mids very well. And I love that mid-gain guitar tone giving you that extra punch. Now, the DS1W is a Wasacraft pedal. And one of the few selected pedals on its Wasacraft line. The concept of Wasacraft is an official complete redesigning of the original circuits by the original developers by carefully selecting the analog components and refining the circuit. Each pedal is a pinnacle of boss design and craftsmanship. Of course, the Japanese symbol means art and technique and it do packs up a hard punch since it has these two modes. Now honestly, it's been a while that I have the DS1, but the standard sounds like the original DS1. But for the custom mode, it gives you that fatter distortion tones and focuses more on the mid-range and increased in touch response, giving you that high gain feel. For those guitar players like me who started in the era of solid distortion like Joe Satriani and Steve Vai, maintains that classic distortion sound but it is combined with a better package of the Wasacraft technology that focuses on mid-range, rich and fat distortion sound, giving you that versatile distortion pedal on your pedal board. Now the DS1 double really do pack some mid-range, especially in the humbucking guitar pickups, giving you that high gain mid-range tone you always wanted. Now the Wasacraft Lion has 12 pedals on its lineup. You may check them out and hear the difference. This segment is presented to you by